So we just wrapped up our Fresh Waves mural project for this summer. So this year we added six pieces of artwork throughout the district. Um, so it's been going really well. We've heard lots of positive feedback about the different, different new artwork that's on display. One can find these murals adorning power boxes, alleyways, and the walls of local businesses. So our most recent ones, um, Mariah Branshaw, who I'm sitting by one of her paintings that she made for the Flower Festival for us. Um, she just um, completed painting a power box behind Cedar and Threads um, that says, Welcome to Downtown Alpena. So that's the final one of the season. Um, but the other ones that we had completed were behind Noise and Toys, Rusty Petunias, and then next to Hopside Brewery. And then there was another power box that Mariah um, painted as well. These new works of art are already having an effect on the activity in the area. Yeah, I think it just really brightens up um, that whole alleyway. We're trying to make it more of a pedestrian friendly space um, so people can use it for music, events, things like that. So even over the last few weeks I've noticed more people walking through the alleyway, taking photos with the alleyway, um, and just kind of enjoying the ambiance that's down there now. While the latest mural completed marks the end of the season, Gentry and her team are already planning for next year. So we actually just were notified earlier this week that we received a $14,000 grant for next year. Um, so this is exciting because we will be able to do more murals. Um, so in previous years, we had only done maybe one or two, um, depending on how many applications we received. Um, this year was our biggest one to date because we received a grant. So we're excited next year um, to hopefully do even more. Applications for both artists and property owners within the downtown district will open in early 2024 for next season's murals. In Alpena, Sarah Shostak, WBKB News.